Welcome to Razorpay. Razorpay is the easiest way to accept and process digital payments for businesses in India. In this video, we will learn to integrate the Razorpay payment gateway with your Golang based custom website. Before we begin, you must complete a few steps. Let us look at them one by one. Visit razorpay.com and sign up for an account. Provide relevant details and complete the sign up process. Complete all the steps and launch the dashboard. Next, you must generate the test API keys. Navigate to the settings section and download the test key details and save it on your system. Before you begin, you must complete the following web-based integration steps. For this video, we will create a Go project with the following files. The main Go file where the orders API is integrated. The front-end file contains the pay button. When it is submitted by the customer, the order ID will be generated. This will open the Razorpay checkout pop-up page and complete the payment. The .mod file defines the module path, which is also the import path for Razorpay Go SDK used for the root directory as well its dependency requirement with other modules needed for a successful build. Step 1. Create a Go project directory. Open the command palette and create the main.go, app.html and go.mod files in your Go project directory. Step 2. Integrate Orders API Order is an important step in the payment process. You must create an order on the server side before creating the payment. Use the Orders API to create the order. Ensure that you pass the order ID that you have received in the API response to the checkout. In the VS Code, open your Go project file. Choose the main.go file. In this video, we will add the orders API to the main.go file. To create an order in your backend server, copy the Go language code and paste it into the main.go file. Modify the values as needed. Step 3 Add checkout options. Open the app.html file of your project in VS Code. The app.html file contains the form where we collect the customer details. To integrate the Razorpay checkout with your Golang website, you must add the checkout display options in the app.html file. Copy-paste the form parameters as options in your HTML code. Enter your API key generated on the Razorpay dashboard. Make changes to the checkout code as per your business needs. For example, you can change the amount, name, description and so on. This is an order ID which will be fetched when the order ID is created at the server side. Step 4. Build the go.mod file. Enter the command in the command palette. Run the command. This builds the go.mod file and imports the Razorpay SDK. This completes the integration process. Let's make a test transaction to check if the integration is successful. Run the project 
and open the URL. In the main.go page, enter the port for the web server. Run the local host testing environment. The .html page opens and displays the pay button. Click this button to open the checkout. Select a payment method, for example net banking, and select a bank. When the customer completes the payment successfully, payment ID, order ID, and a signature will be sent as a response. In case of failure, the customer will be asked to retry the payment. Now let us verify the payment status from the Razorpay dashboard. As you can see, the payment appears on the list. Click on the payment ID to view further details of the payment. This completes the test integration. To start accepting live payments, you need to complete the KYC process and get your account activated. In the dashboard, switch to live mode and generate the API keys. In your main.py and app.html files, Replace the test mode API key with the live mode API key. In case of any queries, contact the Razorpay support team. You can raise a request from the Razorpay dashboard. Thank you for watching the video.